You ever have video where the horizon's not level? Well, I'm gonna show you how to correct that in DaVinci Resolve. All right, let's take a look. I've grabbed a couple of examples here where I was out recording in the field and the horizon just wasn't quite right. Look at this, this is crooked, sort of the uh, Dutch angle. And that's not what I'm going for here. So here's the first one. And then the second one, when I'm at the Jeep, trying to reload, trying to get a nice shot in. I mean, I've cut my head off, but that's fine. This, this is crooked too. So let's quickly show you how to fix this. It's, it's quite simple. So on the inspector tab in the video under transform, there's rotation angle. And you can either grab this slider here and move it back and forth. Just reset that. Or if you put your mouse on the numbers, you can click and hold, and then you can just move your mouse side to side. So then what I'll do is I'll basically line it up with something in the background that tells me that this is no longer at an angle. So we'll go with the trees. The trees should be growing fairly well straight up and down. I mean, obviously there's some changes to that. And we can see the trees here and the trees here. So these ones should be a little straighter. And I'll do about there. And then what I'm gonna do is just zoom in to crop it. And now when we'll watch this, see how we feel about that. And then make any minor adjustments. So maybe, want that a little bit straighter up and down. Right there, zoom in, go back, take a look at this footage. Doesn't have to be 100% perfect at least not for this type of video, but that's certainly looking a lot better, looking a little bit more professional. Now onto this next one. So the Jeep should be straight here, or straight, straighter up and down. So let's, again, make sure you, that you're click on the clip that you're doing. So see how it's highlighted in red, the little red square around it. Straighter. Maybe follow these trees in the background too. Zoom in. Let's take a look at this footage. And that's looking much better. So I think that's it. We're done with these two clips. I'm happy with them. I can use them in my video. So it's all about using the rotation angle and the zoom in the transform section on the inspector tab for these videos. There we go. Pretty simple, straightforward. Check out my other videos. We'll catch you in the next one. See ya.